Well, good morning. Thanks for joining us for the show. And uh, we also know that you're going to follow us in the next three hours on social media and all the relevant platforms we have. Facebook, Join News on TV. Uh, we have a Twitter handle, at Join News on TV. And currently, uh, you can watch us live, not only on Facebook, but also through a regular uh, channel on YouTube, My John Line TV. But we all know it was a busy weekend for the Gaffney New Presidential Party as it went to the polls to elect its national officers. And at the end of the contest, acting chairman Freddie Blair was made the substantive chairman. It was same with acting general secretary John Buedu. And today we'll do a post-mortem with acting director of research and elections of the MPP, Evans Nimaku. Uh, we'll also be hearing from newly elected women's organizer Kate Jimfoa and some political analysts. So we're going to do more introspection, uh, speak to relevant people, the general public, uh, and put all things into perspective. Well, so. Amidst chants of blay, 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 the new patriotic party kept us all away till 4 a.m. before announcing their new dawn. So, great, exciting period it was for the new patriotic party, but um, at the weekend, we all kept ourselves busy. That is, uh, those who did the backroom work and those on air also. Uh, did great work but um, we also know that there are a lot of other issues that we can talk about the minority in parliament is also demanding what it calls a forensic audit into accounts and activities of the ghana national petroleum commission which is chaired by or the ghana national petroleum corporation uh, which is chaired by the newly elected mpp chairman freddie blake and this uh, follows what the ndc terms vulgar opulence and vote buying by the newly elected chairman so we'll be hearing from the ranking member of the mines and energy committee adam mutawakilo so please stay with us as we also wrap up the show with some great and exciting news from the world of showbiz on am showbiz remember as always is brought to you by awake purified water well, we would have brought you the latest news headlines and also uh, would have done review of the newspapers myself um, Mama Vyosu Abwaji and Kujo Yangson and of course uh, we'll bring you all the highlights from the world of sports tennis has been going on Wimbledon but also the World Cup and we all know how it all sets up for the next round of the World Cup and we'll bring you some great exciting issues around the matches that so far have taken place but Let's bring you the latest news headlines we have by way of wrap-up of news for the morning. Stay with us. We're grateful that you're joining us.